Jared is a thriving, healthy three-year-old boy. But shortly after his birth, he was diagnosed with congenital cytomegalovirus, or CMV, a virus that can pass from mother to baby during pregnancy. It belongs to the family of herpes viruses. Uh, it's a very common viral infection. Uh, most of us adults have had this infection sometime in the past, and it usually it's not, it doesn't cause any problems. But of the 40,000 babies born with CMV each year, 15 to 20 percent will have complications. Hearing loss is the most common. With the goal of finding better screening methods for CMV, researchers at the University of Alabama at Birmingham are leading a national study investigating the link between CMV and hearing loss. So what this grant's given us opportunity to do is to evaluate whether we can develop a rapid and inexpensive method to screen for congenital CMV infection. Um, that can be incorporated into the newborn hearing screen program. Standard hearing tests after birth can detect problems, but a baby with CMV may pass the hearing test in the hospital and develop problems months or years later. The key is diagnosing CMV early. Researchers will compare whether saliva or a blood sample is the best screening method for CMV. And that's why we're worried about those silent infections that get missed, and those children may still have hearing loss at six or nine months, but nobody knows to look for it if they didn't know that they had CMV at birth. Thanks to early intervention, Jared has no other effects from CMV, and his hearing tests are normal. He heard a car coming down the street this morning, and he was like, who is that going so fast? And most parents might just, you know, sway it off, but knowing that he can hear those things and everything's fine, I thank God for that.